if my foot is on the ground, up and out of the foot when it's not restrained, and then making it restrained, this arthrogeometric interdependency, which is a term that I probably should have brought up when we talked about joint motion, but I save it, I reserve it for when we talk about closed chains, because it's actually a feature of both open and closed chains, but it makes, it's a unique feature of, of open chains that creates a version of, well, you'll see when we get there. Um, <laughs> but, so think about this. If this foot went up and out when it moved, well, by the same token, around this axis, this thing's going to go down and in. See if I can hold this all still. This thing in vertical, there we go. This thing goes down and in. So as you dorsiflex eccentrically, right, with your plantar flexors, this guy, instead of going up and out, this thing is going to go forward and in around that same axis. Now, why does that matter? Well, as you do something, bending your knee and dorsiflexing at the same time, and it's, it's difficult, I know, for people to think dorsiflexion without thinking dorsiflexors, but we got to think that you're probably standing and you're probably lowering yourself. So your gravity fighters, right, are eccentrically working. So you're doing knee flexion with your quads. I mean, it's actually performed by the resistance, if you get it. Can you envision that? So I'm standing here, and there's something else that can, course, can, of course, alter this relationship. It is the simple fact that your foot, very commonly, when you're doing this stuff, your foot flattens out also. So as this thing, it's accentuated by what happens in the foot. I've got my hand in the way, and I'm sorry. But uh, if I'm sitting here, and this is going down and forward, and the foot's crashing down also, you can see, and I'm exaggerating it tremendously, but I want you to see what's going on. And that is going to drive the knees inward. So we're not really, it's nice to correlate this with exercise and movement rather than just going, here's what this thing does. It's a little offset hinge thing that kind of doesn't.